Peace and love everyone, peace and love. So today, we're going to talk about personalities. How we all have split personalities, different personas, egos. And how to use this more as a tool. And So, to begin with this, it is simply as there's no such thing as a ego being bad and good. Neither the um, personalities being good and bad. The only time it really is bad is when... With the ego is when you identify yourself with the me, 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 or identify yourself with that personality, where you are much more than this, where instead you should be using that personality as a tool. Because otherwise, if you're identifying with it, you're not able to identify with the rest of yourself, who you truly are. You're not able to connect with yourself. So really, you're just separating yourself from yourself, detaching yourself. So... It's like a hammer. You don't identify that you're the hammer. Don't identify you're the ego. Don't identify that you're the personality. See, people get caught up that, and they're often put on the fake mask, and they get caught up in this, where you can use it as a tool. For example, you're having a bad day. Someone comes up to you and says, oh, fuck you. you go, yeah, I'm doing good. I'm doing okay. Put on the mask. But it's a persona where it can be used constructively to merge in and mingle in with society. So if you go on and go, oh, fuck you and go off at everyone, you're not going to be able to interact with anyone. So you put on the personas in need to interact with others. This is when you use it as a tool. You do not identify yourself with that moment. You just recognise it. You can use it to inspire you. When it rolls over you, right, Using your own intelligence against you. You are in control of your own emotions, not the other way around. So everything, use it constructively. Don't identify yourself with it. Don't identify yourself with the me, 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 me. There you go. That I want this, I'm better than everyone. Rather use it as your tool. Because you have, right? You have your ego side. You have your light side. And your, sorry, I meant to say, your personalities on the left. Right? Your consciousness awareness on the right and in the center your ego so dark light your center right so use the balance connect two and one you don't detach yourself from your full dark side you use it as a tool so we are both constant light and dark we have to find a social balance for our own greater good where even anger can be used constructively it doesn't have to be negatively used you can turn a negative into a positive right your positive actions will outweigh the bad so there's a bit of alchemy baby <laughs> you're controlling your emotions you're controlling chemicals right it's also a bit of hypnotism. It's better to brainwash yourself than let the world brainwash you. So you learn how to work with yourself more constructively. You're able to use your power, your higher mind. We are internal mind. Use it. Listen to your subconscious, your unconscious, creative, unconscious mind. It's perfect for that reason. We are gifted with high level consciousness so that we may grow. Peace and love, everyone. I love you all. Connect two and one, mind and soul. Namaste.